once you start using blocks it won't be long that uh, want to make a blocks library site that you could use to import blocks from any other drawings to your drawing that you are that you're using in this lesson we're going to take a look at the design center and how to uh, import blocks from any other drawing to the drawing that you want to have that specific symbol or that specific uh, block. On my screen I've got an architectural example and this example contains many blocks and let's go to, go to the insert icon block and to the insert dialog box. Now I've got many blocks uh, here. I've created many blocks and the shortcomings uh, from these blocks are that if we open another drawing we can't see these blocks. These blocks are just uh, uh, specific for this uh, drawing that are created in that. So how we can uh, use these blocks uh, in another drawing? Actually there's a way for that and that is the design center. And let's take a look at that. I'm going to cancel out of this and remember this is the office drawing I'm going to close out of this and create a new drawing here and from the ACAD default open that okay but let's before uh, importing some blocks uh, make another quick change here go to the drawing utilities and the units change the units to uh, the architectural since uh, the drawings we want to import from uh, is uh, architectural units. I'm going to press OK. To open the design center we have to go to the view tab and click this uh, icon on the palettes uh, panel here the design center or we could use a shortcut which is the control and 2. This is the design center it works uh, somehow like the Windows Explore Explorer that we've got in our windows we can uh, from here go anywhere on our hard drive and select any drawing that we want and import from that now let's click on this home and see where that takes us now the default folder that we end up there is the AutoCAD 2012 folder which is the in the Autodesk folder here and if we want to change the folder to any other folder that we want we can just right click on that and set that as home now this is okay for now I'm going to drag down here and go to the exercise uh, files folder and go to the chapter 13 here and from there we're going to go to the now our file or our drawing is right here and notice there's a plus sign even uh, to the side of this drawing we can click on that and their AutoCAD gives us access to all of the things that we can uh, get from this drawing. Now I click on the blocks and there are all the blocks that are in that drawing. Essentially what we've done here uh, is that we've made all the blocks that we needed uh, in one drawing and we've, and we've saved that drawing as the office for example and from the design center we can access to that drawing and get those blocks from there and this drawing the office drawing is not different from any other drawing it's the same as those and this one contains all the blocks from there any kind of drawing that there uh, they contain uh, the any kind of blocks we can get those blocks right this way and now if you want to insert uh, these blocks from here 
let's make this a little smaller and the design center by the way is a palette we can dock this uh, on our screen and have it now if we want to insert one of these blocks in our uh, current drawing we can just select that and click and drag it on our screen right that way now let's zoom a little out here so we could insert some more of these blocks now it seems that I need to region I'll type RE and press enter that's great now let's insert this floor plant here now notice uh, when I click and drag this on my screen I uh, lose the access point for that specific uh, block or I lose the center point for that block if you want to insert the, uh, the block using the uh, insertion point and the insert blocks uh, dialog box you can just select that block and double click on it and to have access to the insert dialog box and we can specify any option here there's insertion point uh, which is uh, the same as this uh, center point we don't need the rotation click OK and we can click this to have it now imagine that uh, we go to another uh, drawing here and uh, import some other blocks or we could uh, even save this drawing as the furniture drawing and bring all the furniture blocks here and save it within this drawing we could access to dozens of blocks in one uh, drawing and we could uh, make a blocks library just this way or you could make another drawing and contain that with uh, all your landscape uh, blocks or you could make another drawing and contain that with all your appliances and go on and on just like that and whenever you need a block you can insert that just in a few clicks now I'm going to save this uh, drawing here I'm going to click the save as I'm going to call it the furniture symbols and click the save button right there if any time in future I needed those blocks uh, I could access uh, those blocks just uh, using the design center and get those blocks and use it anywhere I need using the design center we can make a small uh, blocks library and use it in the future and any kind of uh, drawing and when we make uh, new blocks we can add those blocks using the design center and make our blocks library bigger and bigger